Today's tech tip is a default program. By this, I mean what program opens a specific file on your computer. If I have a Word document and I double click on the Word document itself, it's going to open Word. But how does Windows know to open Word? It turns out Windows uses the file extension. The little bit of the file at the end of the name. Every file extension is associated with a default program. Some of these make sense. You probably use Office uh, documents all the time, and when you double-click them, they open the respective application within Office that manipulates that kind of file. But there's a lot of things that you have a lot of choices, and you can choose the one that you like the best. For instance, if you open up a picture, a JPEG file, what program opens? Most people don't know this. I know for a fact it's not the program that I want. Uh, let me show you how to change to the program that you do want to use. I have a picture icon here on my desktop, and I right-click on that, and it gives me uh, an option to open with a specific program. So when I select that, Windows identifies all the programs on my computer that can open pictures. Uh, I can tell you the default is the Windows Photo Viewer, so if you're just double-clicking on uh, pictures, that's what you're getting. If you want to choose a different program, you click the option that says Choose a Default Program. This will give you a dialog box where you can pick the, the program that you want to use. Make sure the checkbox that says Always Use This for This Kind of File. Make sure that checkbox is checked and click OK. After that, anytime you click on a JPEG file, it's going to open in the program of your preference. You don't like that program? Go back and try a different one. You have a lot of options. You have a lot of kinds of files, movies, audio, where you should be using the program that you want to use.